The heat, humidity and moisture continues to build across Ontario and Quebec, leading to the threat for severe storms as we head into the day today and into your Thursday. We're seeing the humid X values into the mid to high 30s across the region, even reaching the 40s for areas like the nation's capital. This heat is continuing to build instability, so we're looking at the threat to see more severe storms into the day today and into your Thursday. So for areas in the across northeastern Ontario, western Quebec, looking at the threat for uh, severe storms throughout the afternoon hours, even areas across the GTA could potentially be looking at a non-severe storm into the afternoon hours. So we are looking at a front pushing through that's going to give way to more of that severe threat as we head into the afternoon hours for northeastern Ontario, including areas like Timmins, Chapleau, and in through the regions of Sudbury. Then as we head into the overnight hours, looking at more widespread rainfall pushing through across uh, northeastern Ontario and along the shores of Georgian Bay and Lake Huron as well. But as we head into the afternoon hours, that instability builds. We're looking at the threats to see those severe storms tracking in across the Barrie region, down into southwestern Ontario, and then potentially impacting areas across the GTA for that evening commute. Now, in terms of the overall storm dynamics, it all comes down to timing. So we'll be looking at that more severe threat for areas in through cottage country, down in through southwestern Ontario, and impacting areas of the north end of the GTA. Low class flooding is going to be one of the main concerns, as well as strong winds. And uh, in terms of how much rainfall we could be expecting throughout the next five days into this coming week, we're looking at a bit upwards to 20 millimeters of rainfall locally higher in some regions and of course uh, localized flooding with potential with those heavier downpours in those thunderstorms. Mm -hmm.